Hi folks, my name is Sora, and welcome to my analysis of the first boss of Final Fantasy VII. It might be a good idea to discuss the basics of boss scripts in FF7. Let's start by declaring some variables. Uh, in this fight that's going to be Stage, Warning, Select a Target, and Count, which is initially set to zero. The Guard Scorpion is an interesting first encounter. It features three designs we've seen in prior Final Fantasy games. So that'll be State Change, Counter Attacks, and Predictive Behaviour. So let's try and break it down. In its standard state, you'll see three attacks. Scope, Rifle, and Scorpion Tail. After one of these attacks, Count is incremented by one. On turns where Count is equal to zero or two, Scope will scan one player, setting it as the selected target. On turns with count equal to 1 or 3, we will see either Rifle or Scorpion Tail on the selected character. Rifle is a light attack on a single target, whereas Scorpion Tail will deal a large amount of damage to a single target. When the Guard Scorpion's HP drops below 50%, it's got a higher chance of using Scorpion Tail as opposed to Rifle. So moving on from this, we have the tail raised state. And this happens when count equals 4. And the result of that is it sets the stage variable to 1 and it causes the state change. The first thing it does is it checks the warning variable to see if it's 0. Um, it'll then set it to 1 and deliver this broken message to the player warning them about the tail laser counterattack. And it shows that that message is only shown once. It's very poorly displayed and causes people to attack instead of waiting. Attacks will cause a counter attack called Tail Laser that will hit your entire party for around 75 damage. I recommend doing it once to charge your limit breaks anyway. Um, it just gives you basically, maybe it'll fill up your bars. Um, but in this state, Guard Scorpion's defense is set to 255 from 40, and its magic defense is set to 384 from 255. As a result, any li any actions, even your limit breaks, have diminished results. The state remains for two counts, uh, but after that count, it's reset to zero, dropping the tail and resetting the defense stats. If you use the tail laser to charge your limit breaks, you can use them immediately when it comes out to speed up the encounter. As an overall strategy, Guard Scorpion is weak to lightning, so using bolt spells and attacking with Barrett is the way to go. So next time we'll take a look at Airbuster, who has some equally interesting mechanics to be honest. Um, so see you next time guys.